Hello, 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 it is Sir Jaxi, and I'm not going to do any special graphics for this. Let's play first look, first look, let's call it a first look, because it's my first look at the game. We're playing Natural Selection 2. Now, there's two reasons I'm playing this game. One, it's a free weekend on Steam for it. And two, well, it's highly recommended by a YouTuber that I highly rec I highly respect, and that would be Total Biscuit. And he took and suggested to go watch, you know, try this game out while it was on the free weekend. At least give it a try. So that's what I'm doing. Um, I have actually played the tutorial already. Um, let's see. But I'm going to play it again, just to show you guys what the game's all about, because it's a very different type of first-person shooter. I normally don't play FPSs, so for me, it actually taking, you know, try one out is unusual. Like I said, it's mainly due to TB's recommendation, but in playing the tutorial, I actually found that I enjoyed the game. Now, please don't get confused with enjoyment and being any good at it, because I'm far from any good at it. The other reason, actually there was a third reason why I was downloaded it to try out, and that's because my 10-year-old, oh my goodness gracious, I can't remember his age, let's see, 2000, 2001, 2000, yeah, he's 10, he's got to be 13. Yeah, he's got to be 13. He's 10 now, but he's got to be 13 in three years. <laughs> Actually, he's going to be 11 in a month and a half now or so. Let's see, this is the end of August, October. So, yeah, about a month, he'll be 11. But anyway, he's into shooters big time. Um, I mean, really big time. Ended up giving him a real early birthday present. I got him uh, Counter-Strike Global Source. I got a couple more shooters tucked away for him for for his birthday. Um, but, you know, I figured I'd download this one and see. Um, and if he liked it, you know, I'd have him put it on his computer because he's got his own Steam account. And if he liked it, they're also doing a 75% off special for the weekend, and I was going to buy a four-pack for like $18, $19. Um, unfortunately, his computer, it don't run that well on. Uh, I got to double-check and make sure he's at the lowest settings, but he said he couldn't seem to get the play. He had too much lag. And admittedly, he's got a really cheap older system, so it doesn't surprise me. I may go ahead and get the four pack anyway, and you know, let him play Welcome on to my the ready computer. Room. This two is a team versus team game, so walk towards the blue waypoint to join okay. the marine team. So we're supposed to walk towards there. My volume seems to have reset, so let me show you the options first, since this is kind of like a first look and not so much a let's play. You got a ton of options. First things first. It automatically recognizes your Steam uh, nickname and your Steam logo. If I go back out of this, you can see, surprise the heck out of me. I thought I was reading my mind. It, you know, the minute I logged in, it, you know, not logged in. The minute I booted the game up, it goes Sir Jaxi. It's got my little Sir Jaxi dude with my Lady Jaxi puppy. And it's like, whoa, how'd you know who I am? Well, you know, it's. Take it, leave it to my 10-year-old son. He goes, uh, Dad, you logged in through Steam. That's your Steam account. It's like, oh, okay, yeah, okay, no problem. So it, it does, you know, automatically, you know, it is very integrated within Steam. Let me let me put it that way. So where were we? Options, yes. So as you can see with your options, you can change your nickname if you so choose, or you could leave it your Steam one. Uh, you get your mouse sensitivity, your reverse mouse, mouse acceleration, 
and then you could set the acceleration amount. Um, raw input, I honestly no clue what the hell that means. It's either on or off. So if, you know, since I don't know what it is, it's staying off because that was the default. Show hints, yes. I wish it would show hints on what raw input means. But it does it. Commander help on. Um, draw damage. I guess you can draw damage. If I don't want to draw damage, I can, you know, be invincible. I doubt it. But anyway, rookie mode, yes. Uh, from what it said when I first played it, all rookies, when you go into a live game, are green. That means I'm going to be green forever in this game because I'll never be anything but a rookie. You do also have your FOV adjustment. I'm actually going to turn that up. Oh, you could turn that way up. And unlike in Half-Life 2, I can actually see it doing something. Anyway, so I'm going to turn that all the way up. Um, you got your mini-map zoom. I'm going to zoom a little bit further in on my mini-map than what it's defaulted at. Uh, your armor type can only be green because I'm a rookie. I wonder if I take rookie mode off. No, I'm still stuck with green armor. Because, you know. Anyway, you can change your sex. That, I guess, only matters to the people you're playing with. Because it's an FPS. You don't see your, what you know, your character looks like. So, what the hell. You know. uh, camera animation is off. Let's turn that on and see what it does. I don't know. We'll see. And physics, GPU acceleration. I don't have a physics card. I have a, a AMD card. It's a good card. It's just AMD don't have physics. So, you know. So we'll apply those changes. Uh, let's see. Bindings. These are your key bindings. I'm just going to leave this all default. Graphic settings. You have your device. D3, D9. OpenGL or D3D11. D um, I do believe that this is basically, I believe D3D9 is DX9, D3D11 is DX11, or you could play on OpenGL. Um, I'm not going to mess with that because it requires a game restart. Uh, but I do think if I'm going to play, I'm probably going to play on OpenGL because, like I said, I've got an AMD card and those are really good with OpenGL. You've got your choice of display, default, display 1 or display 2. We're playing on display 1. Resolution, 1920 by 1080. Full screen. Um, wait for vertical sync. Even with this triple buffered, I'm getting an FPS of 107 to 108. So, this does not seem to work that well. If I disable it, though, I go... Yeah, I'm still up in the hundreds. I should... On triple buffered, I should be down in... There we go. It just wasn't registering. It was on triple buffered for some reason. Okay. I mean, having a 60 hertz screen monitor, there's no sense in me having an FPS of 112. It just don't make sense. Texture quality high, particle quality high, decal lifetime. I don't know what that means. So I'm going to turn it up a little. What the heck? Infestation is rich. There again, no clue what that is. Um, you know, I'm not used to playing games like this. If I've got to play this more frequently, I'll research and find out what those mean. But for now, I don't care. Um, Anti-aliasing on. Bloom off. I hate bloom. Sorry, but it's off. Atmospherics on. You know, it's got a good to great amount of customization you can do. Let me apply that. So my buffer... My V-Sync stays on, sound, output device, output device, speakers, head, playatronics, yes, input device, if I go into a live game, playatronics, yes, sound volume, we're going to turn down some, my microphone level is jumping all over the place, I'm actually, can I shut that off now, oh well, 
I guess people are going to hear me talking to myself if I go into a real game. Uh, voice volume, music volume, we're going to turn down some. Microphone gain, if we turn that off, ooh, then nobody hears me, how about that? Go ahead and apply that. And, okay, we're good to go, back. So, we're going to take and resume the game. And it said to walk towards the Marines. Here we go. Okay. Each team has one commander, and everyone else is a ground troop. For now, you will be a ground troop. I'll be a ground troop. They don't trust me to be a commander. Your commander has dropped an armory, a very important structure. Go up to the Blue Ghost and hold E to build it. Okay, we're building an armory. Objective completed. Okay. Good work. But there are enemies nearby. Thank you. Go to the other side of the room, find them, and dispatch them. I have to dispatch the enemies. There's one. No. Okay, he's dispatched. There's another one. Good shooting. Go back to the armory to refill your ammo and health. Simply stand near the armory and look at it to resupply. Oh, I look at the resupply. Another I'm enemy has that. snuck in and is attacking your command station. Uh, Large structure uh, uh, uh. behind the armory. Defend it. The command station is damaged. Go back to the armory, press E, and use your mouse to buy the welder. Okay, I want to buy the welder. Buying equipment costs personal resources displayed at the bottom right of the screen. I want to fix this thing. Use your welder to repair the good work. If the aliens destroy all command stations, Marines will lose. Defend them and repair them. Build structure okay. and waypoint. Now you use your welder to build the observatory your commander just dropped by going up to it and holding the left mouse button. The welder builds faster. Objective How about that? Welder builds faster. Press the one key to switch back to your primary weapon. The observatory has detected more enemies. They show up as red dots on your mini-map on the top left of the screen. Find them and take care of them. Oh man, he killed me! Say, I told you it wasn't very good, these things. It's got something to do with ducking and weaving, or bobbing and weaving, jumping up and down, acting like a... You know, I don't know what I act like, but... Come here, you. Where's my pistol? I'll shoot you. Man, these things don't stand still long enough. There we go, he took some damage. I think I'm confusing him. He's one confused alien. Ah, I got a tomahawk. Here we go. We tomahawked him. Awesome. Oh, gee. What's she do? That oh, gives me a welding gun. What's the weld him? Oh no, I'm supposed to fix the extractor. Okay. I think that's fixed. How the heck do you know when it's done? Whatever. Where's the other guys? Oh, they're over here. It says, oh, there he is. If he's dead. Ah, uh, the other one's behind the counter. Great. Go back to the armory uh. again to refill your ammo and health. Hey, you hear that? I'm great. <laughs> Nobody else will tell me I'm great at games like this. Leave it up to the, the AI, AI dude. Always remember where the nearest armory is in case you need to retreat. Okay. In case we need to retreat. Cool. Your commander has used team resources to research shotguns, but you need 20 personal resources to buy one. To gain oh, resources faster, six. help your team capture and secure resource points around the map. Hold C to open your detailed map and use it to navigate to cafeteria. Okay, cafeteria, where the heck is that? Okay, this way. Yay! Whoa, bad guy. Hey, we dispatched him. Whoa, more bad guys. Oh crap, he's gonna dispatch me. 
Okay, dispatched him. There are enemies here. Dispatch all of them well, to no secure the kidding. area. Man, now you tell me there's enemies here. I thought there were three Resource of them. Resource points are nozzles on the ground that emit gas. Find the one in the cafeteria and stand on it. Oh yeah, you want me to stand on the gas blower. You found okay. the resource point. Your commander will drop an extractor to harvest its resources. Build it. Build structure at waypoint. I guess I do that with my G. Tomahawk? Uh-oh. Where the heck my thing go? Oh well. I don't have my welder anymore. Oh, we'll just push E then. Objective completed. Build structure at waypoint. However, all marine Good structures good. need power to function. Build the nearby power node. Building. Objective completed. The oh, extractor will now produce resources. You will soon have enough to buy the shotgun back at the armory. Go buy it. Cool, I'll go buy the shotgun. I mean, it handles really well. You know, I have to say, I'm not bouncing all over the place. I mean, I could do this number like, you know, those other people, but... Uh, armory. We're buying the shotgun. Awesome. Other weapons awesome. can be unlocked if your commander I'm awesome. Them. More enemies have arrived. You know yeah, what to have. do. I'm not so sure I'm so fond of these, this shotgun. It takes forever to load the thing. It's very realistic though. It does take forever to load a shotgun in real life. Okay, at least this one's just dropping the bullets in. You don't have to do all sorts of funky things with them. I used to hunt and shotgun was my choice of weapon for hunting and I'll tell you I wish I had a cartridge that just popped up that I would drop the bullets in like that never quite that easy is he behind the counter too he says he's over oh there he is let's back up a little good work rookie those are the basics good of play work. marines but there are plenty more weapons structures and upgrades to discover Cool. Now press F4 to go back to the ready room and learn about the alien side. Alien side. Now this is where it gets interesting. Welcome back to the ready room. Now walk towards the yellow waypoint to join the alien team. Their yellow waypoint, I really think, is orange. I don't think it's yellow. You'll see. See, that's not yellow. That is definitely orange. Anyway, got to be an alien. Well spawn. Look at this. We, we got hatched from this egg. We're waiting to spawn. We actually get to play an alien. Aliens start as skulks. You can walk up walls by going up to a wall, looking up, and pressing W. Walk well, up towards this. the ceiling fan now. Look at that. Good. As long as you stay close to a wall or ceiling, you will not fall. A marine is below you. Climb down while staying behind him, sneak up, then left click to bite. Look at that, I'm fighting the thing while he's Good work. Me. Stand near the hive with the large orange organism under the ceiling fan to get healed. If marines destroy all hives, the hive. they win. Defend them. Now hold C to use your map and go to pressure control. Find the marine there and dispatch him. Pressure control. Okay. And we move like, you know, I don't know, mega fast. Now if we hold shift, we're actually moving silent mode. Where is this marine? Oh, there he is. He's shooting me already. Jump, jump, Good hunting. Jump. Look Open at your those map teeth. again and note the thick orange line east of you. This is a vent. <laughs> Find the entrance and go through it. Uh, okay, the vent near me. Oh, it's right from me. We get to climb into vent. You can hold shift to silence your footsteps so enemies can't See, hear you. I already told you about holding shift to silence my footsteps. Didn't work too well on that Get marine, that marine down there. Look at that, I just... Eat. Skulks are useful, but you can evolve into other life forms as well. Yeah, Press B to open this. the evolve Watch. menu, then evolve into the gorge. You get to evolve into one of the rhino looking things. 
And take the mares too, too, because you got actually hatch out of The gorge is a defensive support life form like that can cocoon. heal and build small structures. Try building a few clogs. Press the number two, then two again, then aim at something and left click. Build now, three see, of them. This one I didn't quite get what the point it was by building these cogs, but you know I did it anyway because well it told me to. Clogs can block off passages three, and slow down marines. You can also oh, build hydras which function as defensive turrets. Press the number two, then the number one to select them. Build three of them. Okay, we gotta build three hydras. So two, one. One, two, You need to three. heal them for them to grow. Aim at them and hold right click. Right click. Look at them grow. A marine is coming, but don't worry. Stand near your hydras and let them take care of him for you. Goodbye. The hydras are supposed to be killing this guy. They're not doing their job. Okay, I'm standing near them. Oh, there they finally, go. They finally let's try out them. the flying lurk. Press B and evolve into it now. The flying lurk. Now this one I didn't have very much luck with. I'll be honest, I kind of sucked at flying. I wanted to evolve into the Fade or into the Onos. Those look totally badass. But no, they want me to evolve into a flying lurk. Lurk smooth by flying. Hold W and tap spacebar repeatedly to fly forward, and hold spacebar to glide. Try this now. Pretty Use your map gliding. to fly to courtyard. Okay, wait, courtyard, where is it? Oh man, it's way back here. Okay. Oops, wait, which way? See, that's the problem. I, you got, you hit C. Which means you gotta let go of your W and your space bar, and man, it's just complicated to fly with this thing. And to look to see where you're going. There, fly around the and dispatch the marine in courtyard. Right click to shoot projectiles, left click to bite. I'm just better at biting than shooting my Lastly, projectiles. aliens can evolve traits. Press B, click the yellow icon labeled Regeneration on the bottom right of the circle, then click Evolve. Evolve the trait. I think that's the coolest thing. I wish the Marines now could take it. Regenerate over time. Trait. Your commander decides which traits to make available, and each gives a specific benefit to any life form. Those are the basics of playing aliens. There are more life forms and abilities to learn about, and you can try them out in the sandbox mode under the training menu. You can also practice against bots via the training menu if you don't feel ready to play real games yet. Good luck and have fun. Now, this is the other interesting thing with this game. If we push F, you know, we're gonna escape out of the training. Well, out of this training. We're gonna hit training. Now, the sandbox, I thought that, you know, that would be pretty cool. So I went to the sandbox. Problem is with the sandbox is it's nothing but just that it's a sandbox there's no enemies so there's nothing to practice on I, I didn't like that that was a little bit disappointing I was hoping that there would be enemies in the sandbox but it's more just there to take it you know take it do your whatever So the sandbox is taking forever to load. That's the other thing I've noticed this game does take and have some loading time. Here we are in the sandbox and you know, if we go over and play as a marine, I mean the nice thing is you get to see all the weapons, you know. Come out of the sandbox. This is one of your power nodes. This is your extractor. To the facility. These are where you take and respawn. 
Now, I don't, this is an advanced armory, so it's got everything. It shows you you can buy, you know, little mine turrets. Well, mine, sorry, not turrets. Your shotgun, your welder. They've got cluster grenades, nerve gas, pulse grenade, grenade launchers, and flamethrower. The flamethrower is badass. I love this. Look at this. That's just, that's too much. But there was nothing for me to try it out on. You know, except for my own equipment. I could rush my own equipment. But that kind of doesn't make a lot of sense. So, we're going to take it. Get out of here. The other nice thing with training mode is that they have... Oh, and you can also see the different maps, too, when you go into the sandbox. They also have a versus boss. That was pretty cool. That was actually more what I was looking for for training. You go in, you actually have, and you know, you can set up. You only have one map you can choose from, but you can set up your player limit, and then have, you know, choose how many marine bots you want, how many marine, um, how many alien bots you ha want. If you want an alien commander bot, a marine commander bot, that type of thing. But enough training. Before I end this video, let's take and do one live game. See how bad I really am. Okay, so. Do we want to join? Quick join. Okay. We're just going to do a quick join. It's searching. Now, there should be a good number of people on the servers with it being a free weekend, I would think. So. I don't play the aliens that well, so I'm going to go in and play as a marine. And this server is VAC secured, so cheating will result in a permanent ban. There are some modifications to the server. Face off remake, summit assault, cold pulse, core remake. I know absolutely none of what any of these are. Ooh, coast base jump, coast wither. It's downloading all the mods for me though. That's pretty nice. Coast summit. So apparently, there's a lot of mods that you could get for these maps. And. We did a quick play into a map that is apparently, well, I can't say if this is normal. To me, it kind of looks like it's heavily modded, but it may not be. Who knows? And I really didn't expect this much downtime for jumping into them here. So we're going to pause the video here and we'll return as soon as we go into the game. Welcome to the ready room. This is our ready room, I guess. Okay, yeah, this is where we choose the side we want. And we are going to play as a Marine. There's too many players on this team. You can wait or join another team. Well, as much as I hate to do that, uh, do we want to wait or do we want to take and... I don't know what we want to do. Ah, oh, shit, I hit the space gate. What the hell's that? Okay, I guess the space gate is a watcher mode. Okay, they got a bunch of different ways to watch a game. Not exactly what I was looking for. Okay, does that take us out of here? Go to ready room. Yep. Okay, so we won't walk up to the Stargate anymore. Whoa! What the heck did we just Skulk fall skin. into? Okay, we just became a chomper. I have no clue how, or we fell into a hole, and well, that was the end of that. Eat. Why did I destroy that? Huh. 
Okay, let's go see if we can't find some Marines to eat. Oh, there's one. Oh, but we died. Protect Harvester. They collect resources for your team to spend on life forms and traits. Okay, I'm not sure where I am. Let's go okay. to the We're going to the ready room. Ah, so you fall down the hole and you do a random. Get put into a random battle. How about that? Wait, is this. Man, this guy's all decked out in armor and. Willy Watum, uh, whatever. Wow. Okay. So let's run into the Marines. There are too many players on this team. So how do you know when there's another game coming up that you can take and get into? I'm confused. Can we use change the map? Okay, let's see. Where's the Marines? Marines, hey, again, too many people. What the heck? Okay, well, maybe we're not going to get to see me play a real game. I don't know. Um, play. Let's click play and see what happens. What was that? I don't know what that was. Okay, let's go quick join again and see what happens. Now, I'm assuming there's a way to take and buy more weapons than such. Um, you know, they've got to have some type... Well, I don't know. It's not a free-to-play game, so I don't know if they have a cash shop. I mean, I'm used to playing, you know, when I screw around with shooters, I'm used to doing things like, you know, Blacklight Retribution or, you know, uh, offensive, offensive combat or something like that. Oh, cool, we got to be a Marine. Okay, here we go. Cool. Nice looking map. Now what do I know about maps? Cool. I know it looks pretty cool. I wonder what that thing does. If everything's built, I don't know what we're supposed to be doing. It's obviously we can our... That is what I was going to say. Yeah. So, oh, <laughs> there's people talking. They have, not, they they have built in lab, boy. So I'm hesitant to build one there. But if we can try to hold data core, that might be another good spot. Uh, I've just got to run around. Ooh, F is for a flashlight. Oh, I got a flashlight. Look at that. Got off the flashlight. Two dead things. Well, I just died. Grenade launchers make short work of entrenched enemy positions. Beware of your own splash damage. Okay. They give little pointers when you die, I guess, of telling you how better not to die. How better not to die? <laughs> uh, yeah, okay, I think I messed that one up. Oh, here's the command station. I think I'll start working on sentries for, uh, for the computer lab. Okay, what do I have? I want the flamethrower, so I'm gonna save up for that. That's 24.8 res- Oh, cool, I got 25 resources. I can go buy my flamethrower. I love this thing. It's just so cool. Okay. No, I have absolutely no clue what I'm doing in here. Soldiers are under attack. There, how about the blight? Who needs a flashlight when you got a flamethrower? 
Your base is under attack. Uh oh, the base is under attack. All I know is I'm following these blue arrows. Okay, objective completed. Well, gee, they just disappeared. Somebody completed my objective for me. Oh man, and something snuck up on me and killed me. Who's could just do moderate damage? Why not he killed me? The speed of alien players. Okay, am I like dead dead? I'm dead dead. Well, that sucks. Hey, if you guys kill some air, eco, I'm pushing the computer lab. I'll get huh. some sentries set up in there. Oh, no, here I come. This would take me a while to respawn. There's a uh, couple of skulls. There I go. I, I respawned it. I lost my I lost my my doohickey though. My flamethrower. Okay. Oh, the commander research grenades. Uh -huh. How about I stay out here? I protect the command base, yeah? Getting a lot of activity from uh, the computer lab. Well, after I die again the next time... Oh, see, I told you I should have stayed out there at the command station. I have no clue what I'm shooting at. Just shooting. Do you see that thing just fly by? Yeah, we know our base is under attack. There's a dude flying around in here. Here, we'll help prepare it. E. He ain't helping. Oh well. Your base Here. Is under attack. I'll buy a welder. Says this needs to be heat fixed. There we go. Anything else needs fixing? Okay, I'll just stay here. What? What's that do? Doesn't say. Somebody shooting. Who's shooting? Oh. Okay, I saw an alien. I saw one. Where'd it go? There it is. Ah, killed it. Is there another one around here? Oops, let me go use my welder. Get this thing fixed. Oh, this thing's really down and hurting. They're coming in again. I hear them. Where are they? They're in the vents. They're in the vents. I wanted to say that, you know, from like aliens. I thought that was a good guy. Well, yeah. grenades deal devastating area damage. Great for clearing out ventilation shafts. Okay. Well, it's nice attack. to know, but come on, get me back there. Base under attack. We gotta get in there. Move out! Move, move, move! I don't know. I'm a Marine. What can I say? Objective completed. I got my tomahawk. Whoa! I didn't even see what he did. gas grenades damage alien players' armor and are very effective against scorched defenses. Hmm. I didn't even see anything coming out. Oh wow! They're attacking me before I even get out. 
What the heck? I'm respawning and they're attacking me. Where'd they go? Requests, I guess. Hey, I might be a welder. Okay, who's attacking? Oh wow, the respawner is down. Under oh shit. Command station says they're attacked. You gotta shoot them with the welder. Okay. Let's finish this thing up if we can. So these guys can regenerate quicker. Okay. I don't see how my command station's taking damage. There's nothing here. What the heck is with that? Is there something I can be doing? I'm new. Fight everything. Fight everything. I don't see any. That's, that's good. The heck is that thing? Why is that thing hitting me on the head? Like, like a miniature robot. What the hell? Your base is under attack. Your attack from who? I thought that robot was a bad guy. I guess he's not. It says he's a map. Okay, repair Mac? Oh, I can repair Mac. Sorry, Mac, didn't mean to beat you up. I had to repair Mac because I shot him. Then he came over and hit me upside the head. What are you shooting me for? I'll get the prototype lab as soon as I can. Okay, you do that. Prototype so lab. I mean, it's a fun game, it really is, and obviously you have to work with your squad, because um, otherwise, you know, nobody gets anything done. But me, I'm better off being a rookie just hanging back here and, you know, repairing stuff, especially after I shoot it. That's very smart to shoot my own stuff. Soldiers are under attack. Oh, poor soldiers. I'll be here for guarding the base. Okay. Robotic factory. Builds back. Hey, that thing builds back. Did I get a Big Mac with cheese? <laughs> Okay, well, since I'm pretty useless here, I think you got the idea of the game. Will I be buying it for 18 bucks, 19 bucks for a four pack? I probably will pick it up. Mainly if for no other reason. It looks like a game that's going to be around for a while. I can't say that for a lot of FPSs, especially newer ones, but this one has a very different twist. It looks to have a very active player base. Great to have check it out on a free weekend. So, you know, yeah, I'll probably pick it up. 
And, you know, if for no other reason that when I upgrade my son's computer in the next year or so, he can play it then. Um, other than that, I hope you've enjoyed this first look. I know it hasn't been that much of a look. I mean, I suppose we could run up here and get ourselves killed, but I don't want to do that. Why does that guy say he needs to be repaired? Come here, buddy. I'll repair you. Hey, stay still. I'm repairing you. There you go. You're repaired. I guess they have... The suits need to be repaired. That's pretty damn cool. Okay. Well, this has been Sir Jaxi. If you like the video, go ahead, give it a like below. You could really help me out in my, you know, getting my videos a little higher in the search engines if you favorite it or shared it. That'd be great, too. Um, and, you know, I'm just going to build this structure build waypoint structure real quick. Waypoint. I don't know. Nope, that ain't where it is. It's over here, 47 meters. Um, so, you know, if you like the video, go ahead and like it, share it, do yeah, all that type of stuff. Right if you want more information or want to talk to me or hit me up about other games, feel free to get a hold of me on any of the social networks. I'm on a Nook, Twitter, uh, Steam, Raptor. I stream on Twitch periodically. I'm trying to get into a regular schedule of streaming on Tuesday and Thursdays. Not going so well. I might pick some different nights. I do want to get back to streaming at least twice a week. Uh, and just, you can shoot me a PM here on YouTube even. So, until next time, this is Sir Jaxi, Fading. Ow.